Mixed What's Happening, it's Saz here. So today is something a little bit different because as you know by now, if you see my last video, I'm going to Disney! <laughs> yes, I'm going to Disney. I'll put the link in the description of my last video so you can find out all about it. Um, because most of the videos probably now, <laughs> from now until March, will be about Disney in some way or another. <laughs> um, so I thought today something a little bit different and share with you my new obsession Disney pins I am addicted to these um, my friends Kaz and Rick they got me um, some pins for my birthday and I've never really heard about them um, the last time I went to Disney I was about seven so I can't really remember too much and I don't think they're around <laughs> um, not that I remember of anyway and yeah, so they got me some pins for my birthday and I kind of looked looked around on YouTube about them and oh my god, I am addicted. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna lie, it's a bit of an expensive hobby but it's just so worth it. So without further ado, let's get into the collection. Okay, so my first page because I am absolutely obsessed with Olaf. <laughs> so I've got my Olaf page here, if you can see them. Yeah, these were the first ones I sort of looked at. Most of these I've got from eBay, and I've been quite lucky that they are real. Um, I also use another website called everythingdisneypins.com. Love their vlogs here on YouTube, um, and they are 100% authentic um, and scrapper free, as I'm learning the terms. <laughs> this one was given to me by my friends Kaz and Rick and it says to Anna and Elsa from Olaf and it just opens up and you got a little Olaf and looking on the back of it it is a limited edition of 2000 so that's pretty cool I love Olaf he's so cute this is another one that I thought was really cool it's Olaf I think there's a set of these but obviously I just like the Olaf ones um, and he's doing a little sketch of himself. So yeah, these are my this is my Olaf page. I've only started since September last year. Um, so we're getting there. We've still got time. <laughs> um, Olaf, that came as a four pin booster set. Um, I think Anna, Elsa, and Sven are in the set. Um, little Olaf pin. Um, none of these are limited edition apart from this one. Um, so yeah, that this is pretty cool with Olaf with his little minions, <laughs> as I call them. Um, the candy apple set, obviously I just love the Olaf ones, and a little Christmas one of Olaf holding a present. So moving on, another one of my favourite Disney characters is Tigger. So again, pretty new. Um, I think these were some of the the ones that Kaz and Rick got me in my set for my birthday um, and I saw him and I just had to start a collection because I love Tigger. So we've got the Tigger and the Tigger Chaser, the Sweetheart, the Sweet Characters collection, I do have that, you'll see that in a bit but obviously Tigger's on his own page <laughs> and a few more others. So again we're starting on the collection but these are the ones I've got so far. Moving on, I've got a few complete sets here. So these are the princess shoes, complete set. And then we've got the villains. And then I've also got the Disney Divas set as well. Then on this row, um, these are the ones that Kaz and Rick got me as um, on a lanyard for my birthday. So these are the ones that I originally first had. These ones. Um, Kaz also got me the um, fast pass in um, a big batch that she had that she's going to trade. Um, so I'm with you, girl. I'm going to get some and trade. <laughs> um, and that was on my lanyard and this one as well. Um, speaking of lanyards, I've got the full lanyard set here. 
So we've got the black, blue, pink, red and yellow. They're the hidden Mickey ones. Um, this one I had to get because my nickname at school was always Sassy. Sarah, Saz, Sassy. Um, so I just thought it was really cute and I had to get that one. Um, starting to collect the nerd sets. I'm tempted to buy the full set but I'm going to wait until I'm out there, see if I can get some. And so I've got the three of the head ones, again, that was in Kaz's trader pack, so thank you very much, girl! <laughs> and this Mickey one here as well, so I'm going to start on those collections. Um, up the top we've got the All Star Resort. Um, the first time I went to Disney was in 95, I was about 7 I think. Um, and we stayed at the All Star Sports Resort, so I thought I'd have to get a, a pin. Um, and then it's got the, the music, sport and movies resort, so we stayed in the sport one. Um, and then down here we've got some sketches, which again, I'm going to look out for, for more of the set. Um, it's really weird, once I start co collecting a few from a set, I have to get the full set. <laughs> it drives me mad, I need to have the full set. Um, but then again, with just the Olaf ones and the Tigger ones, I'm okay with that. I don't know why. Can anyone explain that? Because <laughs> I can't. Um, and then I want to start a genie collection. I thought this was really nice because again it says 95 and that's the first time I ever went to Disney and it's got the genie with um, Aladdin and Jasmine. So yeah this is uh, some full sets. I really want to start finding more fast passes as well because I really like the fast passes because again back when I went <laughs> that's all we had the, um, the paper fast passes whereas now obviously you've got all your magic bands and everything so I think that would be pretty cool to see if I can get any more of those. Then we have these ones here. This one I really liked and it was 2015 when I started collecting so that's really cool. Little Mickey. And this is the Sweetheart collection. Obviously you've just seen the Tigger ones. Um, but we've got Tinkerbell, Bambi, Pinocchio, Winnie the Pooh and Dumbo. And then I've got the Tinkerbell and Pinocchio chasers. Then moving on to my alphabet collection. I really recently got these. Um, they are the full set. This is the 2011 set. Um, so we've got these ones here. And then we've got the 2008 set, which I actually managed to get these together. Um, and again, you know me, <laughs> need to have the set. I'm not going to do any more alphabet sets because it drives me crazy. <laughs> Just trying to find the complete set. And I want to start a Dory collection as well because I love Dory. So this is my alphabet page. And last but not least, I know it's not Disney, but it is Universal. And <clears throat> again, another one of my favourites is Minions. Absolutely love Minions, so I've started a little Minion collection. So I've got the clapperboard there with Universal Studios. And then I've got these as a set. So I brought another little bag as well, which I thought I can take out with me. So obviously any ones I do trade, I can obviously put them in here. Um, in here at the moment, I have got some that I'm going to trade, but I'm just going to put them in another bag and then put the ones that I want to keep in here. So at the moment, um, 
again because I'm impatient <laughs> I start collecting the shoes and then I get the full set which obviously means I've got duplicates of them so um, these ones and again I managed to find the lanyard set so obviously I've got some some there as well these are all the ones I've got at the moment um, I'm just gonna buy a lot on eBay and um, they're pretty cheap um, so then I can go around the parks and trade which um, I'm really excited about because I've never done it before so that should be also good fun so yes there you go that is my collection not too bad for a few months worth I think um, as I said I mainly get mine off from a website called everything Disney pins I'll put a link in the description um, they're really good I've had no problems they've all been genuine um, I'm not too bothered I'm not bothered if I if I get a fake one or whatever um, if I see a pin and like it I'm gonna keep it so um, predominantly a collector and I think I will be because I can't afford to go to Disney as many times as I like to um, but yeah eBay they're quite good you've got to be careful they they can be some fakes on eBay um, but again if you're not too bothered like me um, I've been really lucky all the ones that I've got on eBay are genuine um, but again I, I'm not really bothered I like the pins anyway <laughs> um, so yes that was my collection and hopefully by the time I come back I will have a lot more to show you <laughs> Okay guys, I'm going to leave the video there for now, so if you did like it, please remember to give it a big thumbs up, that would really help me out a lot, and don't forget to subscribe to find out when I do more videos, because I've got lots of Disney videos coming up. Also, leave me a comment down below telling me, do you collect Disney pins? Um, if so, what are your favourite ones to collect? And um, let me know. So I'm going to leave it there for now, so until next time, check you later.